Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Eat Stuff. Today we're gonna teach you how to replace the gasket on your big green egg. To do it today, we're gonna use this kit from Smokeware, it's a great company, and this is their gasket replacement kit. So we come, it comes with a new uh, gasket, uh, a scraper, and some acetone wipes to get the ceramic clean before we install the new gasket. So here we go. All right, so I've got our gasket scraper here. Could use a five-in-one tool, but hey, when you've got this fancy Smokeware uh, gasket scraper why not use it so here's our gasket right here they say what's good about this gasket um, as a replacement for what comes on the big green egg it's made out of Nomex so Nomex is really high temperature resistant so anyway we're gonna give it a try we're gonna remove the old gasket with this scraper uh, we're gonna wipe down the ceramic with these acetone wipes and then we're going to put on the new Nomex gasket Okay, so what we're going to do is just find uh, where the seam is on the old gasket. And you can see this one's hard and I've needed to replace it for a while. So I'm excited about this. So, all right, so I found the seam here and I'm just going to make sure I can get up as much of it as I can with this scraper. It's, it's really coming off pretty easy. In fact, see how easy it is. Old gasket. There we go. So now I'm just gonna follow it around with the uh, scraper and really try to dig in and get up because I've got this excess uh, black stuff and some kind of fuzz around it. And what we're hoping to do is get it all the way back down to the ceramic so that the new gasket is going to stick really well. So here we go. All right, so we are done scraping. Uh, we used one of these acetone wipes. Um, so you, you can see we got this pretty clean, but you can still kind of see some black around it, but it's really smooth to the touch. Uh, so we think that this is gonna be a good surface. So I'm just gonna start um, about right here. This is really not hard to do. It really doesn't take long. You just have to make sure that you're careful when you put it on. Just don't, don't pull off all of the backing. Just expose a little bit. I'm gonna use kind of the this inside lip um, of the egg as my edge. And I'm just gonna slowly, with one hand, see I'm pulling uh, the paper off. And I'm not pulling really hard on the gasket. I'm not really trying to stretch it out. I'm just letting it lay. You definitely only want to do this when the egg is completely dry. I watched someone replace a gasket on a wet big green egg that someone had left the lid open on. The ceramic was soaked, the gasket was soaked. Somebody came over and put a new gasket on it and it never ever stuck and we immediately had to replace it. So it needs to be super dry when you put it on. All right, so now that we're almost to the edge here, I've got my scissors and I'm gonna try to make a really clean line and even cut this uh, felt at an angle so that it matches up and lays exactly on the line right where it should so we get a good seal there. All right, so that looks really good to me. Um, and then I'm just gonna rub uh, my hand just kind of all the way around here, make sure it, there are no raised parts. Um, make sure it's stuck on all the way around. And it looks great to me. So now uh, it's time to do the top. So I've had this big green egg for about uh, a year and a half, a little over, and I have not replaced the gasket yet. I got pretty good life out of it. A lot of people replace these every year or so, but I think I have a couple of tips that would help you get more life out of your gasket. One is when you're not using the grill, just keep it covered. Like I have a dome cover that just covers down to here, but that will help make sure that the felt doesn't get wet when it rains. You basically want to try to keep this as dry as you can. So even when you're putting, uh, you know, if you're mopping some sauce onto barbecue or something, it's best to try to keep this clean if you can. So you just want to make sure that the felt doesn't get saturated uh, so that it'll stay, uh, I don't know. Let's move Get on. It. <laughs> All right, so that's how you replace a gasket on a big green egg. Smokeware gasket replacement kit. 
Uh, so if you're interested in this gasket, you can follow the link uh, below the video and purchase this on Amazon. Also, you can follow the link to our blog where you can find a ton of recipes and tips. I'm Adam, that's Rhett. Thanks for watching.